And there's the bell. And here we go. This is the type of battle that you can Damn. show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. Wicked clothesline. What a stomp. Good grief. Impact. What a strike. Got uh -oh. the arm. Oh my goodness, crushing it. Bulldog. Bulldog. Delivered with force. The shoulders are down. One, two, Sit back, people. This one's not over yet. You have to put in a little more work than that. You gotta believe this one's no. over. We've seen champions head into matches maybe a little too confident, only to be picked off in the end. And guys, I can't help but wonder if we're gonna see that again here tonight. Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the Honky Tonk Man's attitude heading into his Intercontinental Championship defense at SummerSlam 1988. We all know what happened to him on that night. <laughs> you are so right, Michael. That was great, of course, though. It wasn't so great for the Honky Tonk Man. He ended up losing his championship to the Ultimate Warrior in fewer than 30 seconds. A lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight. Byron, he looks like he has no idea where he is. Yeah, he is definitely on Dream Street, Michael. Six. He's making a statement here with this attack. Seven. Oh, nasty impact. Back in from the Eight. floor. Lightning fast reflexes. What's this? Mention of Gucci oh. Armor. Absolutely planet. Up into the electric chair. German suplex spiked. This might be the opportunity he needed. He's lining him up. Long way up in the electric chair. Driver! There's a pin now. One, two, three. Oh boy, he is rolling. Look at this. Vertical suplex. Nice. Delivered with force. A kick out. This one's not over yet. Not yet. what's going to happen. This match could go anywhere. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's in a little bit of trouble now. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. He's going to want to make some changes if he wants to stay in it. 
Uh-oh. This just ain't gonna do it. Whoa, he gets out of it. He's at another level right now, Michael. Here he goes. Oh, this one's over, guys. Cover, cover. There's the pinfall and the victory. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. He ain't playing here. He's getting after it here. This was another great moment. He was on point the entire match, as you can see here. There. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. And what an incredible journey it has been to get to this WrestleMania moment. Absolutely amazing. We'll see next match lives up to the hype of the first. Singles match coming up next. has enjoyed such a heralded career in sports entertainment like the Nature Boy Rick Blair. When WWE erects a physical Hall of Fame building, one could make the argument Blair deserves his own wing. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, it's hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. The Nature Boy may be flashy with his robes and struts, but he's also all business in that ring. I can point to 